Hey there guys, Raj here. Hope you guys are well. Today's video is going to be something completely different. I'm not going to be talking about fragrances. This is going to be a fashion related video, specifically talking about my pocket square collection. So hopefully some of you guys will, will find this interesting. Over the years, I've uh, amassed a, a bit of a, well, smallish, medium sized collection of pocket squares. Probably have a few too many than I actually need, but I think they're a really cool accessory. And uh, yeah, I thought I'd just film that video today. I had a couple of uh, meetings today and so dressed a bit more smarter in my suit. And it seems like a perfect time to do this video. So before I get into pocket squares and, and, and what all of my thoughts and before I show you the collection, the first thing to have to say is that it's not essential. You don't have to wear one. They have no real function. Uh, don't be using them to blow your nose, guys, into your silk pocket squares. That's never a good look. Um, so don't feel the need that you have to have one, but I do think you can get some pocket squares which can be very affordable, which can like brighten up your outfit, they can add another layer, a uh, touch of colour and uh, a touch of personality as well I feel. So uh, I, I tend to go for more patterned pocket squares and I don't like to match the pocket square with the tie if I am wearing a tie. It becomes a bit too matchy-matchy. Uh, maybe if you're wearing a shirt or a suit of a certain color, the pocket square can pick up on some of those colors. Or the pocket square could be similar to like your socks or a belt, but nothing too similar. Um, yeah, you know, there are different types of pocket squares out there. Some are more affordable, uh, some are going to like three figures. They come in all different types of materials. I would tend to stick to more natural fibers, you know, your cottons and silks and wools and linens. Um, but yeah, that, that's pretty much it. Uh, so here we go. I keep my, all of them in here in this little, little box. And okay, here they are. So yeah, like as you can see, a lot of pattern here, um, pretty good amount of variety. I always go for some sort of, I don't really go for anything too plain. So yeah, I'm just going to get into all of them. I guess I will start with, let me start with these, let me start with these three here. So these three, as you can see, uh, all are like dotted, all come with little little dots. So the first one, this is one that I, uh, and by the way, all the links to all the, all the brand names uh, and, in, and in order of which I'm mentioning them also will be in the description box. The first one here, and this is a brand which probably is quite well known in the UK from TM Lewin. They're all about sort of putting out men's shirts and suits at kind of good prices, but pretty good quality. This one, 100% um, silk and it has a pretty sort of funky dot pattern with a blue edge. It has a really nice sort of shine to it as you can see as it catches off the light. And this pocket square, you know, I tend to wear this one when I wear a uh, at a black tie event. So I'm wearing a dinner jacket or like tuxedo, whatever you want to call it. And the tuxedo that I have has quite wide um, satin uh, peak lapels, which kind of cover up the pocket quite a lot. So this kind of just peeks out slightly. And I think it's I think it's a pretty cool pretty cool option. In terms of um, how I actually place the pocket square into into the breast pocket of your jacket, well, I try not to do anything too complicated. There are loads of different ways and like origami inspired um, designs you could do. I keep it quite simple. I do a kind of TV sort of like square shaped as you can see here. Or what I'll simply do is just pick up the pocket square like this put my fingers through it like that, twist it a little bit, and either put it in something like that, or try and create a kind of like, uh, a kind of almost like a bundled up rose kind of shape, oyster shell kind of shape and put it in like that. You know, it doesn't need to be perfect. It doesn't need to be, um, you, just, you don't need to fuss about it during the day. Just keep it simple, that's my approach. A couple more here. Uh, with dots on it. Another one from TM Lewin. I think they could do good value stuff. And um, this is a nice one to wear, I think, with this suit because it adds a bit of color and you've got the navy dots in here picking out the color or matching the color of the suit as well. So a nice sort of dot pattern. Again, 100% silk. Silk, I think, is a, a much nicer pocket square to wear when you're 
dressed in a suit. I just think um, it, it creates a more elegant look. Or, or wool also is a good option as well, uh, which I, you'll get into it, which I'll get into in a second. And the final dotted one here from a brand actually that seems to be not doing very well in the UK. They're having some problems. Uh, this one is called Jaeger. But uh, yeah, this pocket square is really nice. Again, 100% silk. And I'm really liking the sort of like blue edges. The blue edges with the green. And uh, the dots in, in blue really sort of pop out on this one. This is a really great pocket square. You can just put it in like that, have some of the edges showing. And um, it's just a beautiful pocket square. It really is nice. You know, these things, they don't have to cost a lot of money. They really don't have to cost a lot of money. Right, so next three here, which again are all pure silk. And uh, this one, again, from TM Lewin. Really liking this design, actually. This goes perfect with this jacket because, as you can see, you've got like a kind of purple interlining. I'm not sure if the camera is going to pick up the... Yeah, I'm not sure if it's going to pick it up, but I really like the intricacy of this pattern here. Really loving this pocket square, kind of nice, deep, dark purple. Um, the light sort of catches, the light sort of shines against this and picks it up really well. I think if you're wearing sort of like a darker outfit, this will just go really, really nicely. So it's a perfect pocket square. Really like, really like it. Something a, li a little bit more fun, um, a bit more whimsical from a brand called Thomas Pink. So as you can see here. Just about. Thomas Pink, uh, they do really good shirts. And uh, they've got this like elephant. I bought this elephant sort of pattern, like circus elephant thing. So, you know, something a little bit fun. A little bit fun. I don't condone uh, animals being performing in the circus, but I still like the pattern of this pocket square. And on this, on this particular suit, it really brightens up the whole life. As you can see immediately, you know, it's, it's the brightest thing that I'll probably be wearing. And if I am wearing colors like this, which are a little bit louder, um, I would keep the rest of my outfit a little bit more subdued because I don't want to be, you know, walking around town looking, looking like a clown, you know, because you have too much color and it looks a bit crazy. Um, okay, so a brand you're going to see uh, a few pocket squares from this brand. I really like what they do. This brand is called Eaton. And I absolutely love this pocket square. The pattern is just amazing. Again, 100% silk. I think this is made in Italy. Yes, yeah, made in Italy. And you've got a nice blue edge around around the pocket square. Not quite sure what this pattern is actually called. Is it like hound's tooth or hound's something? Somebody out there might know. But yeah, it's wonderful. And silk is very, silk is very sort of malleable. You can twist it into all different kinds of shapes and it looks really fantastic on a really sm you look really smart wearing this and it, it, when you wear something like this I think it shows that you, you pay attention to detail of what you're wearing I mean for me pocket squares and what I wear is all about for myself but you know other people pick up on these things and I definitely I, I've noticed you know people tend to, to look at what you're wearing you do I do get some glances and and some compliments also which is you know never a bad thing Right, so I've got a couple more uh, silk ones before I get on to other materials. And this pocket square, actually, I got this one for free, which was absolutely perfect. From the brand Charles Tirrett. They are, again, like a budget but great value uh, shirt maker. And they do lots of other stuff as well. Um, I'll show you the... If you, I'm not sure if the camera's going to... Oh, yeah, it does focus as well. Again, this is 100% silk. And I think the pattern on this is fantastic really amazing the colors are nice and sort of like it's colorful but it's not over the top you know it's a decent quality silk it's not the best quality i've ever ever felt um, i actually had a voucher which came in so i subscribed to esquire magazine and they came with like this 10 pound voucher and this was on sale at 10 pounds so really, I mean, amazing, you know, it looks really great. Again, it looks quite good on this suit because you've got some, uh, the purple interlining kind of goes slightly well with this pocket square. Really like this one, actually. And then the final one, which is uh, purely silk, is one that I quite like to wear on weddings. On weddings, I always think it's good to add a bit of color. And you've got this, 
yeah so it's again from Eaton which you can see here 100% silk made in England and I'm kind of liking the the paisley pattern here it's very very colorful so I don't know how many of you guys feel kind of comfortable introducing this much color into your outfit but with a pocket square because it hides inside the, the pocket and it just kind of peeks out depending on your style you can just show enough color without being too outlandish or you know departing away too much from your style if you're more of an understated kind of guy but I think this is fantastic and at weddings goes really really nicely a little bit more stiffer a bit hard to sort of move around but um, yeah really like it okay so the pocket square I'm wearing today um, again from Eaton really like what Eaton do and this is fantastic because this is again paisley but a, a larger paisley print and this one I think is 100% yeah it's definitely yeah 100% wool and there you go the intricacy is unbelievable and you can kind of fold it in so many ways that each each time you fold it you can kind of pick up on different colors or like today I was showing off this uh, not showing off but I had on display this kind of like floral kind of thing other days you could just have you know this bit popping up but um, just the quality is so good and it's actually fair I think it's quite affordable really a great option 100% wool adds a kind of different layer uh, kind of a different texture to your outfit check out Eaton and check out wool pocket squares um, okay so going on to different materials sticking with Eaton um, this one is more casual th th this is definitely in fact I would say the next I would say yeah the next three I would more I would wear more in like smart casual outfits so I could be wearing not this shirt and not this blazer but uh, still a blazer and a kind of smart button-down shirt smart shoes but you know nothing suitish not really a suit and this is cool again from Eaton 50% um, silk 50% wool uh, made in Italy and this is kind of like a camouflage print I'm not sure the camera is really picking up on the how purple uh, maybe now yeah it's really really purple love this design actually really cool and um, again you know just lifts up your outfit adds in injects a little bit of color a bit of personality and you know if you're a kind of guy who go goes to work and you wear suits don't, I think don't be afraid of wearing a pocket square don't be afraid of letting your personality come through in uh, or manifesting itself in the form of your clothing okay now two more pocket squares to go through from the brand suit supply which I think is probably one of the best value menswear retailers currently out there and um, this one is I think this is cotton and linen uh, yeah pretty much half cotton oh no half cotton half silk from suit supply and this is quite a bold pattern definitely the rest of your outfit would need to be a little bit more subdued so you can see here the sort of like chain almost like a chain detail and the orange really makes this it's like a almost burnt orangey kind of thing really makes this pop again I, I wear this on smart casual and I just like to have this shaped in a um, you know kind of like kind of like uh, like like that almost or the other normally the other way or oh, no no definitely this way <laughs> So yeah, so you've got a little bit of the pattern and the border showing, so it's just a nice touch. It's probably one of my favorite pocket squares actually, and, and Suit Supply do great, um, do great accessories, uh, great value suits, definitely a brand worth checking out. Final pocket square to show you guys, and this is the only one that I have, which is 100% linen. Linen is a very, I feel, a very more relaxed fiber. It takes on uh, a great, uh, just the look or the characteristic of the creases that come through on linen just look really great again uh, suit supply made in Italy 100% linen if I'm honest it, it kind of looks a little bit like a like a kitchen towel or like a tablecloth or something but I still like the design the colors are really nice and bright and you've got some depth in there with the different shades of the green and blue matching together and then you've got this cool sort of green line on the border excellent pocket square I think this is really good 
I probably have a few too many pocket squares, guys. Uh, you don't need this many. But I think for me, if you enjoy something, indulge a little bit. I think a little bit of excess is fine. So guys, what do you think about these pocket squares? Is it something that you wear? Do you know about these brands or where do you get yours from? Um, I thought, you know, this might be interesting for people who are into like fashion or looking to get into something, so looking to sort of step up their fashion game. I think with pocket squares, you don't really have to be some like fashionista who knows all the trends. This is something quite easy. Something like cufflinks are quite easy to get and just... Um, introduces a bit of flair, you know, uh, a bit of color often as well, and I think will make you stand out. So thanks for watching guys, and uh, leave your comments down below, hit the like button, subscribe, and check out my Instagram page. I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.